Welcome back to the channel. And we have the other dilemma again because the mirror has been put in the wrong spot. <laughs> and now uh, you gotta take it out. There's a couple of things you wanna get ready before you even get started. And that is you wanna get some fishing line. You wanna get a razor blade. You wanna have some tape, double stick tape because you need to remount the mirror in the correct spot. Have some paper towel because you need to wipe the mirror after you spray it with some sort of glass cleaner. Now this is a glass cleaner I like to use. And the glass cleaner provides a lubricant as you're using the fishing line to sort of saw your way past the adhesive on here. Now luckily this particular mirror has the OEM adhesive, which is a styrofoam backed adhesive, so it's gonna be very easy to remove. But if you use a 3M tape, it's a little bit more uh, like difficult. So you gotta saw at it just a little bit more. But here we go. First thing, get some lubricant on the glass. I've already pre-cut the length of, get the soap in your eye. <laughs> pre-cut pre the length of um, string I'm gonna use. As you're cutting, this mirror might fall off, so you wanna be able to catch it and be conscious of the fact that you don't want it falling off. So I'm gonna start sawing at it right now. And it happens pretty quickly, so just be careful of that. I don't want this mirror to fall because I'm just taking my time and we don't want to break it. Now it's getting close. You can see it. So this is where you want to sort of grab it like that. Otherwise it's going to fall right off. So I was watching it from the back here as it's cutting. And I knew when I needed to be able to grab that so it doesn't fall. Put it in a safe spot. This is where you want to grab the razor blade now. And the brand that a razor blade I like to use is, is uh, American Line. Get it at your local home center. It's nice because it has a good edge and it doesn't scratch the, the mirror. But you want to make sure you have some lubricant down there so your mirror doesn't get scratched. And if you need to spray a little more lubricant, that's what you gotta do. And just peel that out. Get all the adhesive out. Okay, now all the adhesive is off. Wipe it with your paper towel. see a little bit of residue left then just respray and clean it up a little bit more just be very careful not to scratch there that's how you remove the mirror if you put it in the wrong spot I'm gonna work on the other side and we'll come back all right so I'm just removing the adhesive using the paper towel to protect the mirror keep your fingers away from the blade so just be careful and you can peel back a little bit it's not that difficult just gonna work at it a little bit here there it actually wasn't too bad so this should be a, a fresh start to new this would be a fresh start to a new adhesive right there. Put some tape right here so it's squared up. Get the scissors to cut it. There. Then there's a little cushion in case it drops. Trim the corners. And now this one is ready. Okay, so now that we have the mirror dry with fresh adhesive, we've determined where it should go. Now is the moment of truth to stick it back up here. All right. Got to peel that adhesive protective covering. 
The mirror is on the mirror. <laughs>